hey what's up my beautiful people welcome back to another episode for those new here thank you so much for clicking i am cecilia chopeta and i hope you actually get to enjoy this video in this video i will be showing you how to prepare samba hazis also known as pigeon peas so i used a half of a half a kg of the pigeon peas and i just started off by boiling it as you normally boil beans the next uh you're gonna need some garlic and some ginger and this is the amount i used and then next you're gonna need some a uh, coconut milk so i used two coconuts of which i ended up nearly kamua and this is what i have so this is what i am using right now and i will just pour it all and then next you will need a large onion this was a very large onion so this is what i used or you can use two onions and then this other bit is optional there's some people who put who put in some to who put in some tomato others choose not to but i decided to put in one tomato so i will put uh i have just used one tomato for that next you're gonna bring in your spices so you can add in black pepper you can add in curry as you can see this is one tablespoon of curry and i also added in uh what uh what what spice was that uh some cumin and also i just added in one tablespoon of salt and that is it so also it's optional you can choose to add in some chilies as you can see i added in two chili i did not cut them i did not do anything i just added them added them the way they were at this point do not be alarmed i know they are looking like mashakura but trust the process so just cover it and let it cook as you can see i promised you it's not mashakura just let everything cook until they disappear be it the onions be it the uh, the onions the tomatoes Till everything disappears this next step I used most of my coconut oil in preparing the mahambris and in preparing the first you saw the first uh, the first bit we needed some uh, coconut milk so I ended up with a little of it so what you're going to do is take the remaining coconut milk that you have ensure it's thick so that when you place it back into the fire and you do what i am doing it can become more thicker mine was too light mine was too light because i had over diluted it so just make sure that yours is thicker and after you see that your uh, sauce has become thicker just take it out and pour it on top of your pigeon peas so this is how the final product looks like I hope you enjoyed this video as you can see these are my final products my mahambris and my pigeon peas if you have not watched my mahambri video please the link is on the description box below I hope you watch it too and for now let me just enjoy my dinner I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you learned a thing or two and please don't forget to like share and subscribe this video and also let me know what you would like to see next like what if you have a request on a recipe that you would like to learn about please just comment down below on the on the comment section below and i will get right into it bye and see you next